Hey there, guys and gals, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to Space Pirates and Zombies 2. Once again, we're here, and it's episode 15, and things are about to get really, really, really intense. I can feel it. I can feel it. We just started a war with the Sovereignty of Science. We are also at war with the Sun Hunters. <laughs> And we're almost on the border of the zombies. We're going to kind of avoid uh, taking these particular star bases of the sun, uh, the, sorry, of the sovereignty of science. We're going to avoid these star bases for now. I'm going to let them keep those because uh, they're not going to be able to maintain a war on the, on both, fr on two fronts like that. There's no way. But if we went and we took these star bases right now, of course, that would leave us vulnerable to attack from the zombies. I mean, the zombies could theoretically, they could theoretically jump over here too and start attacking us, but they're far less likely to do that. Um, they're more likely to attack attack the the sovereignty of science bases which keeps them keeps the sovereignty of science even more occupied which is great <laughs> so on the last episode of course we destroyed this star base like it was like butter it just it fell apart it was beautiful it was a beautiful beautiful thing now we've got uh hmm let's see now we want to be careful here so if we start building the star base right now i'm a little nervous that that the sovereignty of science guys are going to jump on top of us and interrupt us but I don't know, no time like the present. Who have we got here? So we've got Silo, who is threat level 39. We've got Nibbets, who is threat level 47. Oh, I guess two of those guys. Oh, I don't know. Should we go help them, or should we go... Should we start salvaging? I think... You know what? We're going to go help them first. I don't know if that's the right choice or not. Who's the weakest? Nibbets is 47. Silo is 39. Let's go relieve Silo. <laughs> um, move two. We're going to help you guys out. Here we go. We're going to replace you in fight. Um, we want to eliminate as many of these guys as possible in this territory now so that they don't interrupt the build. <laughs> two on two shouldn't be a problem. So I guess this is the maximum amount of ships in a battle. And we've got zombies too as well. Of course. <laughs> That's fine. I, I don't think... I'm not too worried about the zombies right now. Oh, let's make sure we're in battle wagon mode there. We almost were not. All right, turn around. Oh, this guy's going down fast. Super fast. Look at his shields go. <laughs> I love it. Just got to kind of stay in range. I think 250 is a really... Well, under 250 is beautiful for this ship right now because we've got some small guns that uh, work under 250. So it's great. We just got to kind of turn, turn, turn so that we can get ready to ram. Of course, we're getting hit by two guys at the same time here, but that's okay. There we go. Ramming speed. Boom. Knock off that engine if we could. That would be fantastic. Perfect. He is done. <laughs> he's finished. He's he's done. He can't. He basically he's going to be flying very very slowly. So he's he's pretty much finished. We just gotta circle around. Maybe uh, hit him again. Don't fly into the asteroid. No, nope, flew into the asteroid. <laughs> uh, yeah. Turn, 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 turn. Come on. You know, you'd think that hitting an asteroid that size would hurt you a little bit more than that. I think they're underestimating the amount of damage that, that would do. Uh, he's just about done. There we go. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Make him... Yeah, there we go. Done. Okay, get out of here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Oh, that was... That was Helmet Head. That was Frankie. Remember Frankie the Helmet Head? Yeah. That's funny. And this is Captain something or other. I don't remember his name. All right, let's uh, send our fighters in. Go get him, guys. He's probably going to try to flee now. Oh, whoa. Didn't mean to hit our friendly. I guess we hit our friendly. My bad. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. If I, The thing is, it's on auto fire for the most part. I mean... Boom! Whoa! Did you see that damage? Oh, he hit, at the same time as he launched an EM Torp, I think that's what happened. Somebody did anyway. Yeah. Oh, he's got some good weapons on there. He's he's pretty good. Oh, he's got some big beam yellow pur or purple beam weapons or something on there. Let's get out of here. Hit the asteroid on the way out. Oh, that hurt. Ouch. Okay, get out of there. Perfect. Done deal. Excellent. Now, uh, oh, we still got some zombies or something out here. <laughs> um, let's take care of this guy. Engaging. Have our fighters take care of that guy. He's kind of out of the way. We'll turn around. Things were... This ship just doesn't have the speed like it used to have. The speed and the maneuverability. It is turning way better, though. I'm enjoying the turn rate on it. It's far better than what it was, even with one extra wing. Ah. I've got to stop it. Thing is, this thing just does not turn. <laughs> I, I gotta slow down sometimes because I, I really want to hit I really want to I really want to fly like a like it's a fighter but it's not a fighter it's a capital ship we need to avoid okay so there's nothing there uh, nothing out in the field here that I desperately need so let's go back to the storm map excellent uh, okay oh nice <gasps> another big torpedo a two star for torpedo nose eh it's all right but lots of look at this is just cold hard cash a ton of it take all excellent um, we've also got the salvage here from the starbase too as well. Oh, I want them both. I want it all. 
Sav scavenge, let's get this one first, because I think... Well, this is going to be good scavenge in both of these. Uh, collect. Uh, what's... Hold on. What else is going on here? Something else is going on. Who is that? You know what? Juvie, I am going to buy your love. Also, another thing that you guys were bringing up, or that you had brought up in the comments, is that we don't... We can... We don't have to always give them just money. We can give them parts. So some of these extra parts that we have taking around... Hold on. How much, uh... How much do we have to earn here? So how much... Do, oh! He, I guess I guess I can't buy him. I can't figure out what what relationship I need with him while he's in the middle of a fight. So that's fine. By the way, if I sound a little hoarse, it's because I'm a little sick. <laughs> um, I was a little sick yesterday too. You might have noticed it from yesterday's episode, but uh, I am I am officially sick. I recorded a stone hearth today as well, and it sounds yeah. You can definitely tell that I'm sick. Ooh, explosive warhead. Yeah, we we've had one of those before. It's another two star too. Wow, good money for those, man. Yeah, let's go for one more, sure. And then we're gonna go. Uh oh, province under attack, Dark Ridge. So, oh, a low output, long range, continuous laser emitter. Seven point eight DPS, three hundred fifty range, but it's there's no stars on it. I mean, good money though. Uh, now we're being attacked over here. I believe this is the one right here, Dark Ridge. So we survived that attack. But while we're here, let's. <laughs> Upgrade the starbase because it's probably gonna get picked on a lot. Yeah, a uh, couple. Yeah, you can really tell I'm hoarse, and I'm so sorry for that. But I gotta play. I still gotta play. I can't stop playing. <laughs> and I, I know you guys had missed the videos if we weren't building videos. Um. Oh, uh, since you're right here, what do we need to get your love? Okay, so this I'm gonna sh demonstrate this now. Offer tributes. So we need 20 points. So we can actually. Yeah, you can see how many points each one of these. Yes, yeah, so we can do that. No, maybe. No, uh, we need 20 points, so we can do this, and then just buy the last little bit. There we go. Perfect! So, yeah, we don't have to just give up money. We can give up anything. We can give them res, we can give them goons. Actually, goons is a way better idea, because we have way too many goons on us right now anyway. So, there we go. Perfect! And offer tribute. Now he can, uh, he can join us. No, no, no. Oh, dude, you're going the wrong way. Oh, man. Ugh. Oh, really? Stop. Hold on. We're gonna no. Let's let's just go repair a starbase. He'll probably join us anyway. All right. So, or build the starbase. We need to build the starbase. This is going to be. We're gonna base this one on armor because I don't think we have much for armor yet. Not that it matters at this point. I mean, we we're, we're gonna have everything pretty much represented, and we're gonna get our wingman. Hey, wingman, dude, the guy with the vampire teeth and the split tongue. Ooh. <laughs> the art is amazing. Okay, you are. This is your starbase. You are welcome, and we're going to. Fund the expansion. We're going to bring it up to five. Perfect. And I'm broke. Wow, that spent all my money. Let's go scavenge the rest of this. Perfect. Because there's probably really... This is this is the uh, this is the salvage from the Starbase. Oh, how come he gets it? How come it's his? Okay, fine. I won't salvage anymore. Hold on. What's what's my relationship with you? 98. Yeah, we can... You can... I, I need... I need the loot. Hold on. Somebody's coming in to attack. Who is that? Oh! <gasps> Dr. Aspro. Yeah, he was the owner of the Starbase. <laughs> Dr. Aspro, I welcome your attack, as a matter of fact. Bring it on, buddy. Yeah. He's level 88, but I've got a 65 with me, and I'm 87. You're toast, buddy. By the way, we're threat level 87 now. That's awesome. It's amazing. Dun, 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 dun. Two on one. He's he's toast. He's, he's, we're just going to waste him here. Attack. Send in all the fighters. I'm going to try not to hit asteroids. That's my new goal, is to not hit asteroids. <laughs> um, it sounds it sounds like it would be an easy goal, but um, for some reason, I, I just keep hitting asteroids. I need a navigator. I need somebody. You know, it'd be cool if, if you had a navigator that says you're getting close or a little... Oh, uh, maybe I'll take care of the, the fail gate first because he's totally going to try and flee. I know, but he, he attacked us. That's a funny thing. He knew we were going to... You know, he knew I had a wingman, or at least he should have known. Uh, just destroy this. There we go. Now, now you're toast. He is going to take a little bit of uh, work, though, because he does have... He is a level 88. Look at all those juicy parts. Uh, let's try to shoot off some of those parts, too, once we kind of uh, get rid of those shields, too, as well. Where's my buddy? Where's my buddy? He must be coming. He's, he's, he's following behind. He's coming. I'm going to try and stay on the opposite side of him so that, you know, his missiles don't hit me. Uh, why are my fighters not attacking? Attack, dudes! Go, go get him! <laughs> Attack! There we go. Um, he's, he's, you know what? He's not, he's not moving that quickly, but he's, my turn rate, actually, my turn rate is just fast enough to keep up with these guys now. Okay, let's go. 
but it seems like he's, he's running. Where is he going? Like, there's nowhere to go. There's nowhere to go, dude. You gotta try and stay away from my, my friendly so we're not, you know, <laughs> sharing, you know, he's not shooting missiles at me and stuff, and I'm gonna try not to shoot him, although I can't make any promises. <laughs> it's always risky. It's always risky being on my wing. I tend to shoot friend and foe alike. <laughs> hey, at least I'm not discriminatory. <laughs> oh, stop turning, stop turning. Okay, this, those SRMs should take care of the rest of the shields there, and then we'll be ready to ram. And here we go, ramming speed. Oh, nope. Kind of missed that, bro. Oh, man. Oh, at least we knocked We knocked off that engine. That's good. He's not running anymore. <laughs> oh, don't hit the engine. Don't hit the engine. Okay, stop firing. Stop firing. Stop firing. There we go. Just want to be sure not to shoot my friendly. Oh, we knocked something else off. What else did we knock off? Um, let's knock off this, this, uh, this cradle. Ah, too late. Too late. It's okay. Lots of parts here. Holy crap. Ooh, a level four. A level four Photonatron. Um, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go Z, and we're going to add that Photonatron to us right now. Uh, I don't remember. Do we have any more? Do we have any more level? I, I think I think we're all set for parts. Yeah, you know what? I think we're, because we're, we've gone sort of the Photonatron route, and I want to kind of start, you know, making sure that we're all Photonatrons now. I mean, might as well, right? Get rid of the brick post, and we're going to add... The level four Photonatron. <laughs> Excellent. And throw that back on. I, I feel like it's risky to rebuild your ship when you're still in combat. I, it doesn't feel safe at all. What else did we have here? We had a level two attack fighters, flat deck. We currently have attack fighters, I think. Apparently there's three types of fighters. Uh, so we've got the laser fighters. I like the laser fighters. I think we still need lots of ways to destroy shields. So I think that's a good thing. We'll put this back on. I, I think that's good. I'm not going to make any more changes to the ship. Uh, let's just take another quick look around. Maybe, maybe. We'll just take another quick look around, see if what else is just lying here. There's lots of level three parts, man. It's all level three. Oh, uh, what's that? I don't know. That's fine. That's fine. Let's get out of here. <laughs> but we got another level four Photonatron. That's really good. Uh, and yeah, there's my level three one. Perfect. Oh, no, that's a different level three one. And we could replace the other part that's not a Photonatron on our ship, too, as well. The Photonatrons are great. They give us capacitor, which we need. We have tons of capacitor because of that. And shields and uh, power, which is great. And another flat deck has spot right. This one is Ion Bomb Fighters. <gasps> oh, I so want this on the ship. Take all. Okay, hold on. Before we scavenge, we're going to go. Oh, level 32. Well, I am waiting. All right, you wait. <laughs> we'll go for the... There's no point in getting a bonus in trading because, I mean, most most of the time, Starbases don't have enough money to cover the cost of what I have anyway. So I think we'll go for health because we have tons of capacitor because we've gone the Photonatron route. Let's go to build ship and... Um, because our right wing is currently SRMs, Ion SRMs, I'd much rather have bombers that destroy shields. Look at all the parts we have, by the way. This is ridiculous. We need to sell some of this stuff or give it away. We can totally give it away. Uh, oh no. We're... There it is. Ion Bomb Fighters. <gasps> 7.8 DPS all to shields. So now we have the three different types of um, uh, fighters available. We have the laser fighters, which is good against shields and armor. These, these guys are really good against shields. I mean, we had Ion SRMs on here before anyway. I'd much rather have Ion Bombers. That's so much better. And then we got the attack fighters, which are good at uh, armor and a little bit on, on the hull. So I think it's a great combination of stuff. I'm pretty pleased. Uh, what we should do, actually, is because, uh, like I said, I want to go all Photonatron. Because that, everything's going to match. I mean, <laughs> we have so little that matches here. I mean, actually, it's not true. We're getting Our ship is look, looking very matchy, actually. But I just want to do this. It's just to satisfy my own. It, it's not even about whether or not the Watch, pyre, watch Spire is not as, if, if it's not as good. I don't know if it's not as good. We could compare them, but, I mean, it gives us turning, turn rates. Oh, turn rates and engine. <gasps> and whereas the Photonatron... Uh, the Photonatron does not give... You know what? No. Hold on. What, what about the, the brick posts? The brick posts give us... No, no, no. I'd rather have the Photonatron rather, rather than that. But you know what? I'm going to keep these watch spires. I would much rather do watch spires because that gives us turn rate and engine. I like that a lot. Wow. Okay. Yeah. We've got we've to keep an eye out for that. Um, I like the Photonatrons, but, you know, and I'll keep, of course, a level four, four Photonatron over that any day. 
I, I don't know. I, there's, I'm getting to have so many parts now. Look at this. We've got three sets of fighters. It's great. Um, let's go see if we can sell some stuff. Uh, actually, before we do that, we've got to scavenge because there's a lot to scavenge. I've got, and we still got the Starbase scavenge, but I think I'll leave that for Buddy. I'll let him, I'll let his uh, transports take care of that. Now below level three to Phono, to Photonatron. Is, <laughs> it's getting hard to say that aloud now. Photonatron, another one. Scavenge. <laughs> We have so many Photonatrons! Uh, Moonshaver, level two torpedo. Wow. We almost don't need this much stuff. Like, I need somebody to come collect some of this stuff from me. Okay, that's good. That's We're done here. We're done here. Um, let's go, oh, let's go get that res because we're gonna need it to carry around all this stuff. And actually, hey dude, 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 come here, I wanna talk to you. Um, Mothello. Oh, we can he, we can get him to join right now. We don't need to give him anything, which is unfortunate because I need to get rid of stuff. Might as well just collect that res. Go ahead, dude. It's all yours. Let's go after this guy, Juvie. Let's let's help him destroy that bandit, and then in a second, like in two, and then he'll be ours. Did he lose? Oh no! Another province. Okay, so we'll have to check that. So uh, join fact. No, no, no. So we need 16 points. 16 points to make him ours. Juvie, here you go. Let's give you. Tribute, 16 points, eh? <laughs> what, what's worth 16 here? Uh, 19, no. 14? Is that worth 16? No. <laughs> we have so much stuff! This is ridiculous! Ridiculous. Okay, that's that's fine. We'll give you the half spot left there. There you go. Besides, you could use that on your ship, maybe. Uh, Juvie, let us make you part of our faction. We're getting lots of new faction members now, too. Like, basically, every neutral I see now, um, we're gonna make part of our faction. Somebody's under attack. Who is it? I think it was a drift that was under attack, but uh, is that over already? I just want to be sure. Picker's Rift? Was it Picker's Rift? I don't remember. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It looks like everybody's okay. Just do a quick check. No star bases are currently under attack. And how much How much money does this star base have right now? It has 2,200. How about this one? 6749? Okay, we're so going there as fast as we possibly can because we need to sell something. And of course, we're going to give stuff to that guy too as well. Trade. Um, do you have anything for me? Nothing for me. Okay, let's sell the most expensive part we have because you've got 60, 6804. Let's sell this sniper cannon. I want to, you know, I wouldn't mind trying it. Wow, this, this flat deck, hold on, the attack fighter 4.9. Is that better than what we have? No, it's different. That's right. Because you know what? I think I'd almost rather have attack fighters in the front. Okay, I'm going to sell this flat deck. We're going to trade that away. And then I'm going to go to build mode here. And because we've got... So here's the thing. We've got the attack fighters versus this one. The laser fighters... Whoops. So the later laser fighters do mostly damage to shields and a little damage to armor and a little tiny, tiny damage to hull. Whereas these guys do damage to hull and health. Now, we already have... Uh, no, see, we've got... See, the ion bombers could be designed... Like, they go out, they take out the shields, and then... I don't know, the attack... Laser fighters are so versatile. But these guys... These guys actually do more damage per second. And they still do damage to shields, just not as much. You know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to go for that. I'm going to change that up. I'm going to do these ones instead, the attack fighters. And then the ion bombers will be to take out the shields, and then the rest of them to destroy the ship, I guess. Once the shields are down, like, we will just rip them apart. I'm tempted to get another ion torpedo then. I don't know, just to help with destroying shields. Do we have anything else? We've got so much stuff. We're almost better off looking in the, in our, uh, just go here and we need to get home. We need to get home, honestly, and then let's go to trade. Just, it's just easier to look this way. So we've got, look at all these photonatrons. Oh my god. So we've got a flat deck. We don't have what is this? Oh, right. That's the long-range beam. That's right. <laughs> so many things to try. And this is a slow-turning... This is a corrosive warhead. Oh, right. That's interesting, too. Crawler left, or crawler right. Moon shavers. This one is the devastating explosive 2.9 DPS. We don't have any other anti-shield anti stuff, but that's okay. All right, so let's get out of here. Just one moment, guys. There we go. I've had my uh, choking fit for the episode. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing happened earlier on when I was doing my Stonehearth episode, Join My Faction. Oh, we're getting so many people, but I need to give away some of the stuff because I have too much stuff. <laughs> Maybe we'll go... I don't know. I think we... Ah, we need to get rid of this stuff. 
Um, and there's no more neutrals nearby. I suppose what we could do, you know, hey, we can do this at any distance. It doesn't really matter. So he really hates us. So why don't we just give him a whole bunch of stuff at a distance and then he's going to like us. There we go. Done deal. This is probably the best thing we could do. Is there any, yeah, this is great. So we can just get rid of our stuff. <laughs> I don't know how they're getting the stuff. Um, but he also doesn't like us very much. He doesn't hate us, I suppose. But, I mean, at a distance, I mean, there we go. Done. <laughs> and they'll probably join our faction anyway. Or if we happen to run, run into them, of course, then then, um, then we can uh, we can talk him into it as well. So that'll work well. Hold on. Let's be sure that we're not overpaying all these guys. Okay, so say, yeah. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Let's go here and give him yeah that's perfect perfect done and anybody else over here hey dude you i know you want to be part of the faction you don't like us very much but guess what i can change that in an instant all you need is a flat deck and yeah yeah you really are yeah you're really nice yeah and we'll give you just a little bit more because i think i need a little bit more in order to uh really befriend you there there we go offer tribute there we go yep 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 <laughs> That's so funny. And then you, uh, oh, you're at war, or you're, or sorry, you're fighting. Okay, so good. That gets rid of some of the stuff that we have. Really, we, we just need to give away a, a lot of stuff. But the thing is, what, what we have left on us now is really expensive stuff and stuff I don't want to give away. We already have seven. Uh, it seems kind of wasteful in a way when I'm giving away. Oh, 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 hold on. Let's just remove remove that one. Perfect. Done. Excellent. Okay, so now, should we go home or should we just push on? I think we should almost push on. Just keep keep attacking. Attack! <laughs> let's uh, let's push into enemy territory. Hardcore. Um, or should I leave this my wingman to defend his territory? I think we're okay. There's going to be enough allies here now to to give to give the sovereignty of science some real grief. What kind of battle you got going on here? So we've got a 54. Oh, this is Mr. Poner. Oh, he's lost at least once. Oh, I want in. I want in on that battle. Or we could just go for the starbase now. While they're all occupied. Let's go for the starbase. I mean, I think we could do it. I think we could do it. Let's go for it. Hold on. Who are you? Roid Runner. I just want to go talk to you, Roid Runner, because... What? Did we, did, did we just... We lost a province? Really? Ah, okay. That's interesting. Um, so... That's fine. Um, that means we gotta be more aggressive. <laughs> I, I guess, I should, I think I could've, I could've increased the, the level of the starbase too as well. Maybe we'll do that. We've got the extra money. We should probably spend a little bit more on the starbases. They're a little easier to defend when they're a little higher level up. Um, this starbase is going to be a problem, actually, too. Oh, who's attacking who? Oh, there. Okay, that's fine. Fun expansion. Get this th Get this right up here. I don't want to lose any more starbases. I don't like losing starbases. <laughs> Obviously, right? So, but that's okay. We're, we're on the warpath. Uh, let's go meet up with this guy. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh. Okay, I was kind of hoping to get you sucked in. Okay, let's destroy the starbase. Starbase is going down! It's going down because Mr. Poner is occupied. Besides that, he's not as tough as he used to be. He used to be he used to be over a hundred threat. <laughs> Ooh, we've got an enemy this time. Oh no, nope, it's three on one. It's three on one actually. I mean this and there's some shields here in case I need it. Uh, let's cook him. Cook him. Um, now we need to watch out for those torpedo launchers because some of these ships, like the, sorry, the starbases, the starbases can have the really big torpedo launchers, which is absolutely terrifying. So, and I think these these things are lasers. I have to sort of be able to identify what kind of pods are what, but I'm pretty sure those have lasers in them. I'm pretty sure there. That's that's where the big guns are going to be. We are getting just blasted by that area effect gun. Got to keep moving. Okay, shields are gone. Let's go grab those shields. Uh, maybe just get out of here. Turn, 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 turn. <laughs> Yeah, we kind of got we kind of got chewed up. Maybe get our fighters going. Come on, get the fighters going. Got some armor there. That's good, but that's not what we needed. Did they take those shields? Ah, they might have taken those shields. I know there was some shields kicking around here, but I think they might have taken them. That's okay. Shields are coming back up now anyway. It doesn't matter. We might have even taken them. I don't know. Attack! <laughs> Kill that torpedo launcher, if that's a torpedo launcher. I think that was the area effect torpedo launcher, the ion one. Uh, this is dead. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Turn, turn, turn. No, come on. Go. No, back up. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Whoa. That was super close. <laughs> we got stuck on it. 
Your heads feel like two, your head feels like two balloons. Okay, yes, anything good lying around here? I don't think so, let's go. <laughs> Another Starbase falls. Mr. Poner has fallen again. Take all, not that it matters. Oh, Red Runner. Yep, we're gonna be getting a lot of phone calls for the next little bit. Did you say Thursday is coming soon? <laughs> All right. Well, um, let's see. What else do we have going on here? Jack Showman. I'm curious about something, actually. Jack Showman, who's threat level 65. Then we've... Let's take a look at Jack Showman. We can! We can actually... We can hire guys from other... We can, we can, we can poach people from other factions. Oh, my God! Oh, we can poach people! I had no idea we could poach people. Oh, that's amazing! Should we just kill Mr. Poner just for fun? Cause we're here. I think we should. Let's just let's just blast Mr. Poner. Cause he's only threat level twenty four. Actually, I'm not even gonna bother with him. Like he's he's, he's a waste of time. Can we build the starbase now? No, because we are broke. <laughs> we have no money. Okay, so we have to go make some money, and uh, we do. We're burning through res so fast right now, guys. Um, is there any... Who can we give stuff to? Let's... Can, do you want some stuff? Yeah, you want some stuff. 32... 32 worth of stuff. Uh, let's give you... Uh... Maybe even more. Something more valuable. You want something more valuable? I got... Look at all this... All these baubles. <laughs> I got lots of baubles. Lots of baubles. There. Here, take that. Offer tribute. There you go. Good for you. Good for you. I, I could be giving away good stuff. I don't even know at this point. <laughs> All I know is we need to sell. We need to get rid of a bunch of stuff. Actually, we need to sell. Selling is key. How much does our starbase have right now? Only 1781. Wow, that's crappy. Uh, this starbase has 1368. This starbase has 35, 34. That's better. We need to make some money. So, I don't know. Let's go grab this res first, though. <laughs> Poor Mr. Poner. He's just getting chewed on. Chewed on so hard. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Um, he used to be really tough. He used to be very, very tough. But not anymore. <laughs> the day of poning is over for Mr. Poner. Oh, I forgot to collect, collect the big loot, too. The mad loot. Oh, dude. Let's go get the scavenge. Uh, hold on. Just be sure. This was our scavenge zone. Yes, it was ours. Okay, scavenge. Because there's parts here. Not that we need more parts, but I mean, we need more money. I mean, but we got to find a way to sell all this stuff, too, as well. Scavenge. The problem is it takes so much time, so much game time to do this scavenging. I debate on whether or not, especially right now, is it worthwhile? I think it is. I think it still is because um, it's, we need money. We need money. Obviously, we need money. We can't we can't afford to buy the start or build the star basin right now. Uh, no, let's do one more scavenge. Yeah, a couple more, I guess. I guess. Uh, yeah, uh, we're just getting level one parts. Let's go. Let's go grab this res. We don't need those goons. <laughs> Oh, dude, you took my res. All right, let's go. Let's go back to this star base over here. It's got some some decent money, and then, uh, wow, we are moving so slow. And look at the res. It's literally it's just falling off of us. Look at res minus two minus two minus two minus two minus <laughs> two. Uh, we we are a fat beast right now. We are so fat. Um, uh, maybe let's let let's Mr. Let. Let Mr. Dr. Vampin Trip off the hook for a minute so he can go rebuild and replenish and do all the stuff that he needs to do. So let's trade. Let's get rid of whatever we can. 3670. Uh, okay, get rid of that. That. Hopefully, we're not selling anything too valuable. I don't think so. I think it's mostly just junk here. 36, 35. Perfect. That's a few things anyway. Do you have any strike craft? I will take your strike craft. 454. Anything left for 454? No, probably not. So let's get rid of just a few of these goons. There we go. Trade done. And uh, let's head over to the other star base over here. Sell as much as we can. Oh, they've got 10,000 bucks. Oh, thank God. 10,000 bucks. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, Robo Buzzkill. Robo Buzzkill. I want I want to talk to you. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, faction full. Oh, there's a maximum amount of people in the faction. I had no idea. Okay, that changes things. I wish I'd have known that before. I would have been a little bit more choosy. I don't want to kick people out. I mean, we could. I mean, this kind of... I mean, the, the key to this game is just being ruthless. Absolutely ruthless. You know what I mean? Like... As ruthless as you can possibly be, the better you're going to do at this game, I think. Just attack, 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 and don't let up. <laughs> oh, repair ship. I don't for want to forget that, too, as well. Let's go to trade. Let's get rid of... Oh, uh, we can get rid of the big laser fighter. Ah, uh, we'll, we'll get... We'll wait on that one. We'll get rid of this and something else worth... 
The crawler leg. There we go. There we go. Do you have any fighters for us? No fighters. All right. Trade. Good. Ha <laughs> ha We're in the money now. Let's go build that star base. And we're we're not bleeding nearly as much res. We're still bleeding res, but not nearly as much. Let's go. Let's go build this star base. Uh, we're, we're, we're pushing through them. Yes, we lost the star base, but you know what? That's fine. Uh, it won't be long before we get that back. Build star base. We're going to make this. It doesn't matter at this point. Uh, hull. Let's go for hull. We need some... I don't know. It doesn't really matter. And uh, can we upgrade this one at all? Yeah, let's, let's upgrade it as much as we possibly can. Two, three, four, five. That should be good. That should be good. That leaves us enough to build another star base. I need a wingman. Anybody want to be my wingman? <laughs> it's it's it, there's nothing but glory, nothing but glory in it for you. Oh, well, let's uh yeah, let's get Doctor Vampin Trip. Let's get him back here. Come on, dude. Let's let's go destroy another star base. We are literally pushing through the. This is is this Mr. Drifters? It is the Drifters, and uh, he is the leader of the faction. Let's destroy the leader of the faction, guys. We're gonna do that next episode. We're not gonna do it this episode because we're out of time. But uh, yeah, this was great. Look at this. We got two more star bases. Or we got no one more star base. No, we got two because we had to buy. Yeah, we had to buy this one too as well. And uh, we did lose one, but that's irrelevant. Honestly, it's it's a drop in the bucket at this point. We're gonna wipe through. We're gonna get this one, then go here, go here. We're gonna get these three. We're gonna recover this one, and then and then we're probably gonna push into the Sun Hunters and start just walking through them. We're gonna just destroy them so fast. The, my biggest problem right now is finding a way to get rid of all the extra parts that we have and not do it in a stupid way. Because now our faction is full. We've got a maximum amount of people in our faction. Just out of curiosity. Yeah, maximum amount of people in our faction. Look at this. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, guys, I'm going to call it. All right, have a good one. We'll see you again. Take care.